So I don't know if you remember these, but I bought these a while ago, and this is just for normal boosting of vegetative growth. Just add one of these to a gallon of water. It's currently day 154 of this ginger germination experiment. Okay, it's day 155, and you can see a small leaf on the left there, three bigger ones, and a fifth leaf in the center. So this belongs to plant number two, has two shoot systems. This is the new shoot system. It's well over 20 centimeters tall. And if you look at this one over here for plant number three, you know it's got three leaves and a fourth one coming out at the top. It's kind of stuck there. I'm going to help it out a little bit. So that one's not as tall, but you know still it's around 20 centimeters. So those are the two bellwether shoot systems of growth and there's probably some growth elsewhere but it's a lot more imperceptible. So there is progress but this is a very slow growing plant species as I've said many times. Why for this tallest plant I think there's been some growth. I think this leaf is new. It's a little taller because I remember that was you know second highest at some point. So if we look here you know this is for plant two. Um, you know that leaf right there that's all folded up that's another sign of growth and you know this is for plant number one so for plant number one there's been some growth as well if you follow it to the top you know that's new regarding plant number four with four shoot systems it's got this new growth here a leaf wrapped within another leaf in a cylindrical fashion so I'm going to try to undo that as well. Um, you know, I'll forget about it. It's just too tightly wound. I don't want to risk damaging things. So this is off of plant number four in the center. I'm going to undo that. Here's a new leaf that's coming out for a shoot system in plant number four. So there's been new growth all over. I hope the fertilizer is starting to take effect already. All right, so I'm gonna water with some good clean distilled water. I'm sure this pot can hold an amazing capacity of water.